fascinating life of mining bees, solitary pollinators with a vital role mining bees, also known as digger bees or solitary bees family Andrenidae, particularly the genus Andrena, lead remarkably complex lives despite their small size and solitary nature. These often overlooked pollinators play a crucial role in ecosystems and agriculture, exhibiting unique behaviors and adaptations that set them apart from their more famous social relatives like honeybees and bumblebees. With over 1,500 described species worldwide and about 67 species in Britain alone, mining bees represent one of the most diverse and ecologically significant groups of bees. 12. Physical characteristics and identification Ming bees display a wide range of sizes, typically measuring between 517 min length, with some species as small as 3 16ths inch and others nearly 3 quarters inch long to 113. Their coloration varies significantly by species, from the striking rusty red coat of the tawny mining bee Andrena fulva to the monochrome black and ash gray bands of the ashy mining bee Andrena cineraria 26. Many species have reddish golden hair and long, prominent abdomens, while others may appear almost metallic. 1. A distinctive feature of mining bees is the presence of grooves running down the inside of their eyes, called facial fovea a characteristic unique to this group among UK bees. Two. Their relatively short and pointed tongues are specially adapted for gathering nectar from specific types of flowers, making many species important pollinators for particular plants. 1. Life Cycle and Reproduction The life cycle of mining bees is perfectly synchronized with the seasons and the availability of their preferred flowering plants. Most species emerge in spring March June, though some, like the ivy mining bee, appear in late summer or autumn to coincide with ivy flowering. 25. Each female mining bee is a solitary architect, excavating her own nest tunnel in the ground without help from others. These tunnels, typically 10-20 cm deep and about a quarter inch in diameter, often feature a distinctive volcano-like mound of soil at the entrance. 2610. The burrow structure varies by species, but usually consists of a vertical main tunnel with smaller side tunnels terminating in individual cells. 10. After mating which often involves males swarming low over nesting areas in search of females the mated female begins the laborious process of provisioning each cell 13. She collects pollen and nectar from flowers, forming them into a pollen ball, which she moistens with nectar. Each ball serves as food for a single egg she lays on top before sealing the cell 16. A female may create multiple such cells in her burrow throughout her active period. The eggs hatch into larvae that consume the stored pollen and nectar. When mature, each larva pupates and remains underground through winter, emerging as an adult the following spring to continue the cycle, 1013. This means most mining bees have just one generation per year, though some species may produce two. 1. Nesting behavior and habitat preferences country to their solitary designation. Mining bees often nest in aggregations where soil conditions are favorable, sometimes numbering in the hundreds or thousands of individuals in close proximity. 213. This communal nesting provides several potential benefits including enhanced mating opportunities, shared protection from predators, and optimal environmental conditions. 13. Mining bees show distinct preferences for their nesting sites, typically choosing areas with bare or sparsely vegetated soil good drainage aspheric soil textures often sandy or clay soils south facing slopes in many cases 71013 these requirements lead them to nest in diverse locations including lawns, gardens, parks, sports fields, riverbanks, coastal grasslands, quarries, and agricultural land 26. The bees' excavation activities actually benefit the soil by improving aeration and drainage, with their soil piles disappearing soon after nesting activity ceases. 210 Ecological Role and Importance Mining bees are vital pollinators for both wild plants and agricultural crops. As some of the earliest bees to emerge in spring, they play a crucial role in pollinating early blooming plants when few other pollinators are active. 4. Many species are particularly important for fruit trees like apples, cherries, and blueberries, as well as crops such as strawberries. 413. Some mining bee species are oligolectic, specializing in pollinating specific plants, while others are polylectic, visiting a wide variety of flowers. 4. Their pollination services not only support biodiversity, but also improve the quality and yield of commercial crops, with studies showing wild bee pollinators enhance fruit production regardless of honeybee abundance. 4. Unfortunately, 
many mining bee species face conservation threats. In Europe, the Andrenidae family is considered the most endangered bee taxon, with only about 22.3% of species appearing non threatened for habitat loss due to urbanization, agricultural intensification, and natural vegetation succession are primary threats, along with pesticide use and climate change. For 1 3, interactions with other species, meaning bees have complex relationships with other organisms in their ecosystems. They face predation and parasitism from various species, including BFLI's Bombylius major, which hover near burrows and flick eggs into nests where their larvae consume the bees' pollen stores and young to nomad bees' nomadus bp, which are kleptoparasites that lay eggs in mining bee nests, their larvae killing the host's offspring 56 Lathbury's nomad bee, a specialized parasite of ashy mining bee 6 despite these threats. Female mining bees have developed defensive behaviors like closing nest entrances when disturbed or during rain to protect against intruders 26. Human interactions and management mining bees often come into contact with humans when they nest in lawns, gardens, or school grounds. While their sudden appearance in large numbers can be alarming, these bees are remarkably docile. Females rarely sting unless handled roughly, and males lack stingers, altogether, 71,012. Educational initiatives are important for promoting coexistence with these beneficial insects. Schools and parks have successfully used signage to explain mining bee biology and reduce unnecessary fears. 1,213. When management is needed, experts recommend tolerating their short activity period, typically 4 minus 8 weeks. 1012. Improving turf density to make lawns less attractive for nesting. 1013. Using heavy watering to discourage nesting. 10. Avoiding pesticides which harm these important pollinators. 1 to 1 3. Conservation and future outlook. The conservation of mining bees is increasingly recognized as crucial for maintaining biodiversity and food security. Protected areas like Poland's Campinos National Park have been shown to harbor significant mining bee diversity, including many threatened species. 4. Maintaining open habitats through traditional land management practices appears vital for these ground nesting species. 4. Citizen science initiatives encourage people to record mining bee sightings, helping researchers track populations and distributions. 2. As awareness grows about the importance of all pollinators, not just honeybees, mining bees are gaining recognition for their ecological contributions. The life of mining bees, though brief and often unnoticed by humans, represents an extraordinary adaptation to early spring pollination. From their intricate nesting behaviors to their vital ecological roles, these solitary ground dwellers demonstrate that complexity and importance come in many forms in the natural world. Protecting mining bees in their habitats ensures the continuation of their essential pollination services and maintains the biodiversity that sustains ecosystems worldwide.